yours? Well, seeing as how I can't do anything right, you probably dump me soon, so don't worry about it. Why would you say that? You're beautiful and smart and fun. And you've got my genes, remember? Yeah, but I've also got dad's. Oh, stop being such a teenager and tell me about your boyfriend. Fine. His name is David. He lives in my dorm. He's a chemistry major. He plans on going to med school. Oh, really? What kind of doctor does he want to be? He's been talking about going into cosmetic surgery. And what do you think about cosmetic surgery? I think he'll make a lot of money. But what do you think about the practice of cosmetic surgery? I guess if it makes you happy, it's fine. I'm glad you feel that way because my breasts are fake. <laughs> what? You mean mine are going to stay this small? How long have you had them? About 24 years. How did I not know this? There's no way you could know. They're five years older than you are. <laughs> Becky, you'll never guess what mom just told me. She's a space alien. She had a boob job. <laughs> she had a boob job with my favorite butt? What? Where'd you get that line? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Mom? Mom? I got a deal on them. That's fair, I guess. And why are you so upset? Because I feel genetically cheated. Stick with your chemistry major and maybe you can get a deal on them too, dear. By the way, Anna, she smokes pot too. What? You're lying. I asked you not to tell anybody, Rebecca. I just thought that since she filled me in on one of your secrets, I probably owed her one in return. You have a point. Proceed. Anyway, she caught me hotboxing the bathroom and I thought I was toast, but instead she says, Oh, I wish I could join you, but I have an important meeting this afternoon. No shit. It turned out you're human after all, Mom. I'm glad you two finally realized that. What do you say to a round of margaritas? And then we can talk, then we can walk down to the beach and check out the surfers. Dig it. Yeah.